Hey guys, it is me, Happy Sarek, and welcome back to Lion Center Travel. So, some great news. This Forlorn Fair event still continues. We still have three more days and seven hours inside of this Forlorn Fair event, and I'd like to progress there because I have no idea when this Forlorn Fair event will come back again because developers did mention in one of their Q&As that they'll try to release this Forlorn event, uh, Forlorn Fair event a bit more frequently, but how much more frequently that's going to be, I have no idea. Once a month, twice a year i have no idea in any case i have gotten this junk repository there we can store 3000 items worth of junk like for example 3000 batteries 3000 gold so that's awesome and yeah now my next goal is to get this electronics crate and little by little we are going to be doing that but before we do this i want to do a couple of raids and we can already go for the first raid of the day except before we do that we have to go and clear the farm location i've already gotten all the resources that we need for the farm so let's hop on our chopper and let's clear the farm location it's been actually a couple of days since i've cleared it so yeah that's gonna be kind of interesting to go and clear that farm location and uh, yeah after that we're gonna do a raid hopefully we'll get something nice hopefully that'll be a decent raid because not every raid is decent uh, the maybe every 10th raid is fine but hey, every 10th raid maybe is going to give you like an entire inventory of loot and then those raids become worth it again. But I think it's been a really long time since I've gotten a really worthwhile raid. So I don't know, maybe I've already done 10 raids and I've gotten garbage. In any case, let's go to the farm location. And while we are running there, I'd love to say welcome, welcome to all those that have just joined the stream. Glad to see you here. Welcome, 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 everybody. And if you're watching this live stream after it's over, you already know what to do. Hop to the pinned comments down below. There you can find timestamps and you can navigate to your favorite parts of the live stream a bit quicker, like us doing raids, us opening up blue crates inside of the farm location and bunch of other stuff. No raid last time. We need a juicy one. Exactly. We do need a juicy raid. It's been a really long time since we've gotten a juicy raid. Plus, during the last live stream, we didn't even raid, so maybe we'll get something. 10% good raids and 90% goop raids. Actually, I'd say, like, maybe that's about right, maybe. Maybe that is actually about right. A lot of the bases are goop. Some raids are good, but most of the bases are goop. Also, I'm pretty sure you already know this, but I've gotten this machete blueprint. So now we have, like, probably the best melee weapon in the game. And I absolutely love that. Oh, and there's another thing that we're going to do today. We already have a lot of Forlorn Fair confettis, Forlorn Fair weapons. So we're going to use all of that stuff today. All of those Forlorn weapons. Maybe we'll go to the swamp location. We'll, eh, not to the swamp, excuse me, the sewer. We're going to go to the sewer location and we'll use that stuff up there. Okay, let's get that green coupon. Kind of don't need it, but hey, we can exchange it now for the floppy crates. You need 150 yellow tickets. I have no idea how many green tickets you need to exchange that stuff for a yellow coupon. The sad part is that I didn't get a spread shot. I definitely should have gotten a spread shot for this farm location, but that's all right. Okay, I was able to use that spread shot quite nicely. Eh, not the spread shot, but the minigun. The minigun was quite amazing. And on top of that, we are also progressing inside of the season pass little by little. So we are already at level 72. And there's no way today we'll reach the level 80, but perhaps... Also, I think we've gotten the Dragunov and I still haven't claimed it yet. Uh, where is it? We have to have it. There we go. We do have this Dragunov, so maybe I'll claim it and I will recycle it once we get back to the base. Maybe we will get something. Confettis are hard to, to get. Uh... I wouldn't say that they're hard, but they... We don't have a lot of them. Like, it's not like you can get thousands of confettis per day. You get, like, what? Four? Six? Seven? And maybe, like, twelve or something confettis? Depending on which stage you are. At what stage you're at. So, yeah. Alright, let's deal with another Savage Giant. Nice. Uh, let's get that flare gun. Wait, did I loot the trash? Not the trash bag, but the, the other thing. I forgot how it's called. Okay, these raiders are just a joke. They came here to fist punch me. Bunch of donuts. Bunch of donuts. Did it drop anything good? A broken machete and... Okay, this road sign is pretty decent. Like, on my other account, I would absolutely take that stuff. Again, we do have better melee weapons. That's why I'm not taking it. But... That's nice that we've gotten a full durability road sign. It is pretty, pretty good. Okay, let's deal with that stupid rotten yokel. Goodbye, mate. 
Some of the zombies are really fast. They're at the speed of you, and I don't really know if I like that. The more I play this game, the more I realize that it's super annoying that these some of the zombies are very fast. And they just chase you. Like, there's no delay. Like, you turn right, and they'll turn, like, absolutely right. They'll follow your path, and it's very, very annoying. You can't dodge them. You can't outrun them. And some of the zombies... And, and, just, and that just becomes annoying. But it, it is... What it is. You should take the charcoal. You're on the second stage. Absolutely. Thanks for the reminder. You are a bloody genius. Let's get that charcoal. Because we totally need it. Now, we need to give 20 charcoal every day. And yeah, I might be running out of charcoal at the base, so thanks for the reminder. Okay, let's deal with this guy. Oh no. Okay, the savage giant. Okay, got him. We got the dude. Okay, perhaps here we'll get a barn key. Nope, no barn key here. It's fine, then we'll go to the other side. We'll go all the way there. Oh, plus we have that Revenger beautifully. Maybe like, Sarek, it's not a Revenger. Are you sure that it's not a Revenger? Because it, to me, it looks like it's a Revenger. So it must be a Revenger. Okay, how about we... Okay. There we go, we just destroyed the schmuck, easy. I love this machete, that's all I have to say. This machete is amazing. I actually want to even use my melee weapons more when we have that great machete. Uh, let's craft two more bandages. And hey, once again, welcome to all those that have just joined. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Hello, hello. Hopefully you're having a great day. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Today's plan is simple. We clear the farm location, we do a raid. At least that's the plan for the beginning. And then we'll try to do more raids. Obviously. As always. Well, except during the last live stream, we didn't do any raids because we had other things to do. <sighs> Alright. Go on, something nice. I mean, there's nothing nice. I just want my barn key. And charcoal. We got the charcoal. Do we always get guaranteed charcoal? I think sometimes we don't get it. In any case, I'm glad that we got that charcoal there. We've gotten an entire stack of it, and now I can bring that stuff uh, to the Forlorn Fair. Alrighty, how about we aggro this rotten yokel? And how about we deal with the savage giant? First of all, let's open up the door. Okay, I'm gonna wait until this dude comes here. And you can still wall trick them, whoops. Except you have to move and don't stay in one spot. Okay, we did that. And the bull is walking. Do I kill those bulls? Maybe I'm gonna keep them. Maybe later on, raiders will want me to, like, kill three bulls or something, and I'll be able to come back here and kill them. Okay, maybe shouldn't have eaten that jerky when the stage two forlorn event requires us... Uh, requires us to have 20 jerky every day. But whatever. It is what it is. There we go, we dealt with one more Savage Giant. Kind of cool that they also that they also give us 150 points towards the Season Pass. Oh, we've gotten a Flare Gun. So yeah, occasionally I get a comment from you guys asking where to get Flare Guns, and boom, that's where you occasionally can find Flare Guns. It requires Berry Tea too, yep. It does require Berry Tea. However, I am cooking it. Little by little, I am cooking some Berry Tea. So there's that. Okay, how about we open up this barn? We've gotten another puppy. Let's loot quickly the bike here. Um, a gas tank. Okay. Understandable. So the farm location is great now. If you need to find chopper gas tanks, chopper forks, chopper wheels, you can get that stuff at the farm location inside of this barn. Again, it's all random. Sometimes you do get it, sometimes you don't, but... Okay. There is that. Wait, do we have a lot of enemies attacking us? Right. There were a few of them. Okay, 
there. We dealt with that savage eye. And that is it. We have cleared the entire farm location. Let's open up now the box. And we've gotten this blue heavy handle, which we have all the blueprints already. We don't need to have here anything else. So that gets my approval. We're going to bring this machete back to the base. And the valuable survivor's diary. We're also going to bring that because in one of the Q&As or something, developers said that we might have some more levels. And yeah, I'm going to get these valuable survivor notes back to the base just so that we... I can level up faster once those new levels come out. When they'll come out, I have no idea. Maybe in a year. Maybe in 10 years. I don't know. It's like, when are you going to play Cyberpunk? Uh, Cyberpunk? I don't know if we'll be playing it here on the channel. I did play some of it when it came out. Pub the Survivor Diary now, says the A. Stop it! Don't encourage me. I want to keep that Survivor's Diary for later. Hey man, did your time of stream change? It's a bit late in our time, but hey, uh, good to watch your stream again. Am I late, says Jason? I do live stream now a little bit later. Uh, feels like more people are online around this time. Because when I live stream earlier, it feels like there are less people there. I don't know. Feels like it's a perfect time for the live stream. Alright, let's up here. Saving for new levels? Absolutely, I'm saving it. Pop it, says DA. Guys, stop it. I'm not popping it. Maybe I will try to read it. But at the same time, it does nothing. I almost popped it. I almost popped that diary. Hey, so I've already accumulated uh, 47 diaries here. Plus, we have a decent amount of diaries in the inbox. So, there's that. Uh, Gooper. We have the instinct to pop anything, to be honest. I agree. I agree with that. We already have a stack of confetti. How do we get that? Blech. We got a lot of confettis. Okay, let's drop these thingies and the coupons and a bunch of other stuff. Okay, let's drop the food. I'm gonna drop the charcoal all the way in this chest here. And we got some copper to drop here. Also, maybe we're gonna recycle that minigun later. If almost, almost I wanted to say developers, but if raiders will want me to recycle that minigun. Sometimes they want me to recycle three weapons. So there's that. Uh, this, let's drop the machetes. Whoops. They do not fit. Let's drop them here. The flare guns, and that is it. Now, let's talk to the raiders, and let's go for the first raid of the day. Bleep plop. We are ready. Take care, pink lady. Take care. Kill the blinder with confetti guns. Oof. That would be like the, 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 the biggest waste of those confetti weapons. But hey, we can do this. This live stream is all about being wasteful. So maybe we will waste those confetti weapons. Can you put diaries in the bookshelf? I don't know. Didn't try. Probably. Except I don't think I have a lot of them. But I still have some space in the bookshelf, so let's try to do this. I'm gonna try to put those diaries in the bookshelf, maybe it'll work out. It'll be kind of ironic if you can't put books in the bookshelf, correct? It'll be silly if you can't do that. It works! Diaries can fit here, ladies and gentlemen, they do fit. They do fit. Um, now, we need hatchets. We totally need hatchets. They fix the bug, now the butcher doesn't go back to heal. Uh, what? I mean, it's fine. We can still kill the butcher. Today, we're gonna go to the transport hub. So, we will figure it out. Okay, let's craft five hatchets. 
two, three, four, and five. I'm getting a lot of weapons as if... A lot of hatchets as if this is going to be an insane raid. Something tells me it'll be goop. 47 diaries. Pop them all, says DA with a five pound super chat. Thank you, DA. Thanks for the super chat. Are you mad? That's the question that I have for you, DA. Are you mad? Um, I need to drop some armor here. Just eat an antarad to curb your craving. Maybe a little, says DA. Okay, so DA, just for you, right? I'm gonna, like, read some of these diaries, all right? Three diaries, that is it. I've read three diaries. I didn't pop 47 of them because that would be crazy. But I did pop three of them just for you. Actually, I need to pop two more. Uh, one diary for, for each pound. There we go. Two more. Boom, boom. So there we go. Thank you. Thanks, DA, for the super chat. Thanks for the support on the channel. Thanks for everything. And yeah, I'm not popping 47 diaries. diaries. Pop them all rolling on the floor, laughing, rolling on the floor, laughing, rolling on the floor, laughing. Pop them all. Guys, I don't want to pop them all. I don't want to pop anything. Uh, however, if I find an anti-rat, I will pop it. You can I give you that Cyrex guarantee. That I will pop those anti-rads. LDOE raid player. Okay, let's see. What do we have? Anything decent? Or just a whole lot of goop? <gasps> I think you already know what it means when we say, eh. You already know that this is a nice base, right? However, let's up. Did you know that it can store in VAP up to 300 items of every item? I saved, the uh, I saved their thousands of items. Very nice. Congrats on saving the berry tea raid. I mean, if we get berry tea, I'll get it. Right? I'm not gonna say no to that berry tea. So yeah, this is the raid, ladies and gentlemen. This is the raid. However, let's not judge the book by its cover. Well, not at least yet. Let's open up all these chests. We got some carrots. All right, I'll take that. So far, I see zero berry teas. I might have been bamboozled. Um, goop. That's what I see so far. Just a lot of goop. The good part about this raid is that it's a simple raid. But that's say That's where the advantages of this raid end. Just because it's simple doesn't mean that it's good. Five first eight kids. You know what? This base does have more loot than it looks like. We've raided bigger bases with stone walls that have less loot than this. So. Yeah. Do I need both of these hammers? I don't want to bring hammers back to the base. Why am I taking them? I still took them. Whoops. I still took those hammers. Take the wood. We have the wood. We've got plenty of it. Okay, let's go. Chop the racks to look for berry tea. That's what I'm doing. I'm gonna probably chop down that fireplace as well. Oh no, my armor is completely broken almost. Whoa. Does it even make any sense? My armor is completely almost broken. It make yeah, it doesn't make sense. It's almost completely broken. That makes more sense. In any case, let's get the fuel. I'll take all these tickets. Now I have storage to store the garbage. So let's get it. I also probably can store the broken phones. So let's get that. Uh, nothing. You guys told me that I can find berry tea. 
So, excuse me, where is that berry tea? Hmm? Where is the berry tea? Get the charcoal. Did that base have any charcoal? Uh, nothing, nothing. Oh, we do have a stack of charcoal. How lovely. And we got more carrots. Alrighty. Beautiful. Let's now skedaddle from this raid. I don't even want to fight the last wave of zombies. So, how do I raid this base? I don't know if it gets IX approval, but it could have been worse. It looked like a lot worse. It looked like it is going to be a lot worse. Again, it's not a great raid by no means. However... Let's say that it was a bit better than I expected. It gets Sykes approval, whatever. I'm going to give Sykes approval to this base. It's a 3 out of 10. Is it a 3 out of 10? Did have some healing items. Like, aka food items. I don't even know if I want to give it a 3 out of 10. But let's give it a 3 out of 10. Welcome to Happy Sykes Livestream, Cyric. Says Borden Sus, welcome. Hello, Cyric. Welcome, Cyric. Just greeted myself. Um, I'm gonna drop the carrots. Now I can drop the tickets. I can drop more goop up there. Bam. I don't even know why I took that garbage. It's just that we have the junk repository. I might as well fill it up. Okay, let's drop these hammers here. Uh, this goes there. And nails. And ladies and gentlemen, that is it. We have sorted out our inventory. Are we going to go for the second raid or... Yeah, maybe let's go for the second raid before we start doing that forlorn fair. Um, charcoal goes up there. What's with the tribe background music? I have no idea. That music just appeared out of nowhere. I see 50 berries in Sykes' base. What? I am cooking berry tea. I have berries and I have berry tea. I'm cooking it. That's what I'm doing. Put the junk storage close to spawn to be efficient, says Born Sus. No, but thank you for the for the advice. Even though that, that was a horrible advice, like literally borderline, uh, borderline, like stupid. But thank you, regardless. I know you've tried your best. Thank you. I have to pay those writers. Can I pay them with this broken armor? How about you take my broken socks? Nope, they don't want it. <laughs> There we go. That's a lot better now. Let's call them on the radio. The devs should remove berry tea. I agree. Still, I'll never forget how somebody told me once that they drink berry tea because you pee less with that berry tea. Till this day, I can't fall asleep. I just keep thinking about that. Okay, now we have other tasks to do. We need to stay in 20 waves. We need to kill Ravager at the farm. I mean, we've just done that. This, that, uh, three puppies and 20 waves. And the PD is not reset. I can't go there anyways. Ladies and gentlemen, the second raid is here. Whoa. The second raid is here. Almost here. Almost here. We just got to raise some puppies first. How about we raise this gooper? Um, this gooper. And uh, what else can I do? And whatever, another gooper, for example. This and this. I mean, this one is nice. Wait, leader perk by plus five. Do I have... Wait, 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 wait a second. Leader five. Leader three. 
Okay, this is a leader of four, so this dude will go away. Where's that level three gooper? Maybe I can sort the by rank. There we go. There's got to be a level three gooper. Not this one. Not this one. This one. There we go. Uh, how about I rename it? Can I even rename it? It's Gooper L5. There we go, we're doing it. Now I'll need to have another Gooper that does more damage. And everything's going to be great. Yeah, that's it. Let's just go for it. Gizmo. And maybe I'll even feed them a bit. We do have some food, right? Some turkey, so I might as well just do it. I might as well just give them some stuff. It's like, do you remember the days when you were afraid of Leviathans from Subnautica? It do be like that. Subnautica was amazing. I loved that game. Do you recommend building the kitchen stove? Is it worth it? Not really. I mean, if you have spare resources, sure, you can do it, but I wouldn't really advise you building it. And Carlo Vacek, thank you for becoming a member. Thanks for smashing the join button. Welcome to the stream, Carlo. Welcome, welcome. You're just in time for the second raid of the day. Welcome, welcome, Carlo. And to those that have just joined the stream, welcome, everybody. Let's get ready for the second raid of the day. The first raid was... Uh, it's pretty bad. Hopefully the second rate is a bit better. Okay, this Glock and this Glock. It's like 50% durability Glock. It's not enough. Okay, then I'm gonna get... This instead. I'm smelling some guns, says Biraja. Hopefully! Maybe we will get some guns. Two raids in 25 minutes. It's like Birthmas, says the A. It do be like that. I feel like Santa Claus here. Giving these raids left and right. Okay, let's craft five hatchets. Um... The first raid was good or it was good. It did get Sykes approval, but it didn't have guns or or first aid kits, but it did get Sykes approval. I had a C4. Did I just drop it back in the base? Probably I did. Okay, let's get one of those. When's Rust and are you gonna try out CS2? I'm already playing CS2 off camera and maybe there will be more Rust in the future. Also, play 1994. This might be a good base. Maybe like Cyric. I'm not sure, but I do believe it might be a good base. I'll do you raid. Play 1994. Maybe I'm just imagining. <laughs> Probably another goop! Or maybe it's amazing. Keep watching to find out. If this base is 10 out of 10 or 0 out of 10. Did you get your purple machete blueprint? Yes, I got it in the in the video about the Forlorn Fair event. Do you gonna do a live stream when you gonna change the base at the settlement? Says Shu. Maybe. I have no idea. Uh, am I gonna use a C4? Maybe I can go outside. I think the reason why he doesn't play CS on camera because he's goop. I am goop. But the reason why I don't play it is because nobody's interested here. 
of me playing CSGO. Excuse me, CS2. CSGO is dead. CSGO is gone. I'm gonna place that C4. I don't know if I want it, but we have C4s! And I'll use them. I almost got stuck there. When can I do raids? I'm level 150. If you're level 150, you can already do raids. Just call raiders on the radio. And then you can start doing raids. Okay, we're gonna get these tickets. I'm gonna bring that stuff back to the base. Because why not? I'll get these iron plates, as I don't really have that many of them. I think we can also store wrenches now inside of the junk, whatever, repository, whatever it's called. So let's get it. <sighs> More of those. So far, we're getting a lot of gold. Dude, Valorant is much better than CS, says Ahmed. I, I wholeheartedly disagree about that. Imagine playing Valorant. <laughs> Right. What do we have here? Nothing. At that point, I'd rather play Fortnite than Valorant. Um, I'll get the nails. That's what I think Valorant is. Valorant is like an inferior version of Fortnite. It's like, do you play Fortnite? No. I don't think I've ever played it. That's just my... My opinion. And most of the time, my opinions are facts. So there we go. Okay, let's skedaddle. You're violating. No, I mean, just somebody said goop in the chat, so I had to, to answer it with goop. Honestly, I've never played Valorant, and I don't care about it. I don't know if it's a good or a bad game. I literally have no idea what's the difference between... There's Valorant, and there was another game. Uh, I don't know. In any case, it's all goop. CS2 is where it's at. And that's it. If you play Rust, can I join you? Wait, let me think. Probably no. But hey, thanks for... Thanks for asking. If you have any other questions, let me know. I'll definitely make sure to think. Okay, let's drop the hatches. Let's talk to the raiders again and maybe we will... And maybe we will get another raid. <laughs> Two raids were garbage. But it is what it is. Play Miss Survival. There will be more Miss Survival one day in the future. Let's drop the nails. Um, here. Then I'm gonna drop those wrenches. And the gasoline. And there we go, we did it! The inventory sorted out once again. Now we can talk to the raiders. Play Frostboard, says the A. Sure. If this live stream gets. Three likes, I will play Frostborn. We'll become the Frostborn channel. I'll only play Frostborn. Sorry, be careful. You don't want any accent dents to happen. Guys, stop those jokes about dents. I don't even know what's what's with a dent meme, to be completely honest, but okay. Understandable. Okay, we gotta kill the blind one and open up three green crates. I don't think I can because I've opened up already the blue crates. We can do this. We need to kill Colonel at the factory that we can we can do this. And then we need to kill the blind one. Okay, these are pretty basic tasks. Let's do them. Let's do it, ladies and gentlemen. Um...
I play Frostborn, but I feel like the devs focus more on Lazarus, says Patrick. Okay. Understandable. Have a nice day. Uh, Colonel at the factory, so let's get some weapons. A shoddy. It's probably more than enough. And then... After the colonel will get back to the base, I'll get more guns and we'll go... Actually, I don't want to go back to the base. We won't have to go back to the base. We'll just go to the hard mode bunker alpha right away. Is that enough? That should be enough. Do I need another set of armor? I'm not sure, but... However, I will get... When is another free-to-play video coming? Very soon. I don't know how soon, though. Like, in the next... It should come out in 2023. That's what I can probably promise you that. There's like a 95% chance that that video will come out in 2023. So it... It will come out this year. When? I don't know. Okay, let's go to the... Whoops, not the farm location. I wanted to go to the abandoned factory. Bruh, says Bump. What do you mean, bruh? It is gonna come out this year. Recycle the guns. We are gonna recycle them once we get back. But I, I meant to go here. We could... I, I want to go clear the abandoned factory first. Then we'll do it. Then we'll clear Bunker Alpha. More scum survival videos, please. There will be more scum survival as well. I'm not sure when. But there will be more. Okay, stop these jokes about dents. I have feelings. Recycle the doggo, please. You can't recycle them. I've already tried that. You can't really recycle them. What if this free-to-play video isn't out this year? Then it's gonna be out next year. I guess. But it will be out this year, guys. It'll be out soon. Whoops, didn't modify these three weapons. <gasps> Disappointed! Thank you very much. I got a grenade. The goopers are identical. Yes, they are. Okay, the colonel is dead. That's all I had to do is just deal with the colonel. Okay, now let's leave this place and let's go to the hard mode bunker alpha. We're gonna activate the hard mode. Yeah, we'll go to the third floor. We'll kill the blind one. Why do you disrespect the flare gun? What? I don't understand. What do you mean I disrespect the flare gun? I literally use them. I take them with me. How is that disrespecting them? I really like your Funny Raids playlist. I still watch them now. I have no idea if I... I didn't even know that I had a Funny Raids pr playlist. But okay. I'm glad that you're enjoying them. It's like I'm sorry that I was talking about dents. It was an accident. Okay. I get it. You guys want me to suffer. One, four, six, eight, five. One, four, six, eight, five. And that worked! Thank you, Ella. Thank you so much for the password. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate that. 
I didn't have to open up Discord to find that password. However, ladies and gentlemen, if you would like to join our Discord, then make sure to join at discord.gg slash happycyric or link is down in the description. Mm -hmm. Sometimes occasionally I chat there. Like, I, I, I think I've chatted there like a few months ago. It depends. If people ping me, if I see something interesting, I will respond. In any case, make sure to join the Discord. And there you can also find passwords to uh, to bunker alpha. Playing too much last on earth can be detrimental to your health. Okay. Last on earth is now part of me. I haven't played Last on Earth in two weeks, says some guy. Oof! Oof! Can we get an oof in the chat for the for the dude that hasn't played Last on Earth in two weeks? That's insane. For two weeks? That must be crazy. It must be shaking. Oof, says DA. It's absolutely oof. Imagine not playing Last on Earth for two weeks. That is crazy. Unbelievable. First of all, I, I'm pretty sure the dude is lying. I don't think there's a single person, a single Last on Earth player that hasn't played Last on Earth for two weeks. It's unbelievable. Floppy crate. We might open up a floppy crate later on because we do have some floppy crates. We also have some yellow coupons that we can give. And yeah, then we will probably do a floppy crate. Maybe. I'm retired from professional last dinner. Professional last dinner. Did we even have last dinner professionals? But okay. Okay, the dude's going to pop. Thank you very much. Thanks for popping. It's like, where can I find flare guns? At the farm location. That's one of the places you can find them. There are probably more places to find them. Maybe the chat will help you out. Perhaps. We are all last in Earth professionals, says Scarlo. Alrighty. Hello, professionals. Welcome to Last Dinner. Maybe I should refer to you as professionals. For real. How's your day, professionals? Um, I'm ready to hope inside and deal with the blind one. It's like, why did my dog die at my base? I don't know, you're imagining. Probably. You have to wake up! What's last on Earth? Um, I don't know. Last on Earth is life. Last on Earth is love. Last dinner can make you happy. Last dinner can make you sad. Last dinner can make you angry. Most of the time it makes you cry though. That is last dinner in, in a nutshell. Mostly cry, yep. <laughs> mostly cry. That's what Last Dinner does. It makes us mostly cry. I once bought an AK for like five dollars and a minigun, and then I died to a French giant. Nice. You can still pick that loot up. 
I lost two technical backpacks with all in perk at the laboratory. You shouldn't get that perk. It's a pretty bad perk. We did it. We destroyed this dude. Let's get the coupons. Let's probably skedaddle from here. Except I'm going to drop these bones because we don't need them. Also, this bone over here. Can I zoom in and move it here? Yeah, it's better. See, guys, this bone here. It looks like some sort of an orange or whatever. Every time I see it, it reminds me of some sort of a fruit, but whatever. It is what it is. Did last earth make you a better person? I don't think I can answer that. Because I don't see myself from the side. But I'd like to believe that, yes. <laughs> what is even this live stream? What are we talking about? How to get tactical backpacks? You can get tactical backpacks by doing the supply event. Sadly, we do not have the supply event right now, but... Uh, is it even coming anytime soon? I think we've had that supply event quite recently. Sorry, the supply event is not coming anytime soon, but once it's there, you can get it. You can also get the tactical backpack inside of the gas station by spinning caps. Okay, let's give these items. Let's give that green coupon and let's skedaddle. Ladies and gentlemen, let's go for the third raid of the day. I think that bone looks like a strawberry. Maybe it does look like a strawberry. Maybe. I got three purple Winchester mods from the season rewards. My eyes didn't cry, but my heart did. That is very deep, DA. That is very deep. When your eyes don't cry, but your heart cries is when it hurts the most. Okay, let's get that all. What can you use bones for? To upgrade your weapons, to modify them. To modify your spears and probably your pipes. It's like, please respond. If the survivor's legendary pack is still in the game. It's probably not. I don't know. Uh, let's go back here and let's yeet the... Wait, I still had the bones. What did I delete then? Probably nothing. Okay. Let's delete the pants. And that is it. Let's get ready. I'm hungry. You should eat something if you're hungry. If you need more tips and tricks, let me know. Why the raids aren't worth it anymore. I mean, so far we're getting goop raids. I don't think they're, they've changed the raids or anything. Raids have always been like that. I'm just being dramatic that, oh my guys, guy, eh, oh my god, guys, raids are garbage. They're not worth it anymore. But they've always been like this. But I haven't gotten a good raid in a really long time. Maybe the, th the third time's a charm, right? Maybe I'll get something decent this time. I'm ready. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm ready. Are you ready, though? Oh my guys. Stop it guys! I just said something incorrectly once. And now it will hunt me forever. And now it will hunt me forever. Okay, we need to recycle three guns. One, two, and three. Oh my guys, God. Guys, stop it! I did not say that. There is no... Somebody said you can recycle low durability guns and yet... Oh, maybe full durability. Whatever. Forget it. Forget what I just said there. Forget it. Okay. Let's do this. Also, this box is... Is emptier now, too. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. It's like, what's the difference between black and dark... I mean, 
black is a color, dark is a shade of color. It's a shade probably, right? So, I mean, they're completely two different things. Uh, how do we drop? How do I find space for aluminum? There we go. That's where I drop that. I recycle three guns and now we can go for the third raid. I think the raids have changed after the last update. Nah, I don't think so. I don't think they've changed. I think raids are... have always been like this. Dark is the absence of vision or light, says Born Sus. Excuse me, I would politely disagree. I mean, dark doesn't mean that it's complete darkness. It doesn't mean that it's like pitch blackness or something. It means just that it's dark. In any case, I don't even know why we are talking about that. Is premium worth buying? I have no idea. It's all up to you. It depends on your financial situation. Oh my God. Ella, thank you for... Thank you for being a member. Thanks for smashing the join button. Thanks for supporting the channel. Really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Also, thanks for sharing the passwords. To Bunker Alpha. And now we can go for, for the raid number three. Yes. Raid number... Three. Uh, the brain is working today at maybe 50% capacity. So I am a little bit lost. However, I'm going to get a C4. I have everything I need to have and that's it. We can just skedaddle. I don't know why I had to drive that chopper. It just feels nice to drive it. Psych, premium is $2.40 for me. Is it cheap or expensive? It depends. It all depends, mate. Yo, what's proud us? <laughs> Thanks for the super chat. Welcome back. Welcome, welcome for the good evening. Oh my guys, God says this proudest. Thanks, man, for the for the super chat. Welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome. By the way, during the previous live stream yesterday, I did go to the swamp location. You were not in the chat, but I still went to the swamp location. So there's that. And uh LDE raid uh, Rilla. Um is this base any good? Or is it goo? Okay, it's this and uh, that. Okay, I see how to raid this base then. I get it. Let's go for it. Premium is 12 euros on my Android and 10 euros on my iPhone. Okay, fair scamming. <laughs> so guys, as I said many times, the I'm not a financial advisor, so I can't advise you what to buy in the game and what to do with your money. Okay, we popped that wall. I thought we'll get more loot. I'm probably gonna explode one more wall here as well. I don't know what kind of loot we can get here. I don't even know if it's worth it to use these C4s, but uh, here I am. Using these C4s left and right. Oh, the dude exploded! I'm happy with it! Thank you, C4. Thank you, really cool. Okay, how about we open up... 
another wall. Just made sure that I don't have any other C4s. Nothing, nothing. Okay. No. iPhone is expensive. Maybe that's why Kefir is giving discount. Just making stupid guesses is boring. Side. The Play Stores... Probably, like, Play Stores uh, take different cuts. Even though, if I'm not mistaken, the Apple... The App Store and the Google Play Store, they should both take, like, 30% cuts. So, I don't know why on some of them it's more and some of them is less. But it is what it is. It's been like that for a while. Also, the prices differ by countries. But yeah, the discrepancy between Android and uh, iOS prices in the shop have been like that for a while now. Discrepancies. What a beautiful word. Um, one, two, and three. Okay, now let's go to the to the top. I actually want to open up another wall here to see if there's anything inside. Let's go. We'll make a little bit of noise, but I want to see if we can find anything inside of here. Probably nothing. It feels like we'll get nothing here. Ooh, there's a red chest! I'm telling you. <laughs> Grenade launcher is inside. <laughs> just water. We just got water. It's like learn a new word by himself. I didn't learn a new word by myself. I knew discrepancy. It's just it's a it's a funny word, discrepancy. Play Store also gives different discounts and coupons from time to time. Plus you have the play points. Yep. And also when people say that iPhones are more expensive, iPhones aren't really more expensive. It just depends. You can buy like a pretty cheap iPhone. As well. And a Sproutus. Uh, thanks for the super chat. If you want to go again, sorry I fell asleep. Uh, oh, if you want to go again, sorry I fell asleep. Uh, Sparta, thanks for the super chat, and uh, I don't know if I'll go to the swamp location today. I don't know. I can't promise anything. Okay, we'll get that copper. I don't even know why I'm taking it. We have like probably hundreds of it, if not thousands. Probably not a thousand. Okay, that's that's too much, but we do have hundreds of it. Okay, leather. I do have some iron, but I don't have space to store it in the base. In any case, let's skedaddle. So this was our third raid. Was this base worth it? I don't know. <sighs> I don't think so. So yeah, let's skedaddle. Six out of ten, says Biraja. What did we get that is six out of ten? Two sets of SWAT sets? That's why it's a six out of ten? Excuse me, sir. This raid was like pretty goop. This raid was pretty goop. It's like I smashed the like button on the video. DA says that we got 45 likes. It probably you haven't refreshed the live stream. Or maybe we do have only 45 likes. So you guys, smash the like button. Destroy it, annihilate it. Thank you for smashing it. Is the second recycler worth it? Depends how often you recycle. In my, like, probably humble opinion, probably not, but it depends on the way you play. So, yeah, I don't believe that the second recycler is actually worth it, like, in my opinion. It's not like you probably have an insane amount of things to recycle, and if you do have an insane amount of things to recycle, then you do you. By having an insane amount of things to recycle, I don't mean, like, recycling... Uh, oh my god, it's like, I have hundreds of broken dad boots. Like, they're pointless to recycle. You'll just get more rope. Right, if you have, like, hundreds of batteries to recycle. But at the same time, you can just use your one recycler and that's it and not rush. I don't know. It's up to you. Uh, 
Um, leather, leather, leather goes here, perhaps. And we need to drop some iron and copper. I'm recycling 100 turret parts. Turret parts are pretty decent. You can get steel from them. You might be like, Psych, how do you know that? Because I'm glad you asked. I do have some turret parts here. Except I don't recycle them. I just keep them. What do you think about Kefir raising the level cap to 499, says Bump. So if we have 500 levels... Maybe that'd be cool if, if there's a reason for it. If we just... If we just go... Wait, I just got lost. What I wanted to say. Because I saw another super chat from Asproutus. Asproutus, thanks for the super chat. The location was near the third watchtower. If you want, let's go there. But I don't want to go there. Let's say hi to the Can Game YouTube and to the guy Bump. Love you all, guys. Asproutus, thanks for the super chat. Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. So I forgot what I was talking about. Whatever, we will go to the swamp location then. Do we go to the swamp location? I mean, I kind of want to get Ashwood anyways. Yeah, whatever. Let's just get that Ashwood because I kind of want to upgrade some chests. Like, I'll go there for five minutes to get some more planks to upgrade my rack and that's it. I mean, it's not that... It's not a crazy idea. I kind of wanted to go there for a while. You were talking about the 500 level cap. Oh, I get it. So if developers raise the level cap and we can level up to level 500, like there has to be a reason, not just, oh, you can level up to level 500 because it's kind of pointless. Like same thing as level five walls. We've gotten level five walls, but they're pointless. So yes, Pratis, thanks for the super chat. And we're gonna hop to the swamp location. Do we get the ghillie armor? Probably not. I mean, I'm already here. Might as well get it. Correct. Absolutely. Pretty cop. The location was near to the third watchtower. If you want, let's go there. Let's say hi to the can game YT and to the guy bump heart heart heart. Love you all, guys. Just so Pratis, thanks for the super chat. And take one MGL, says B Roger. We're not taking any MGLs. Stop it. Get some help. Does the premium go up in price when it's the end of the season? Does anyone know? I think I've seen it go up in price. Yes, when there are like only a few days left or something, the premium pass uh, usually loses the 50% discount or whatever other discount we have there. So yes, Sproutus. And to the angry Cyric, I forgot him. So it's a Sproutus. Thanks for the super chat. So yeah, now we are in the swamp location. We're going to get two stacks of wood and I'm skedaddling from here. Get the corn seeds as well for the Forlorn Fair Stage 3. As I said, guys, I'll probably never unlock that Stage 3. I mean, maybe I will unlock it one day. But yeah, it'll take me forever to unlock that stuff. I'm still only on Stage 2. You need like, what, 17 to 18 days to, to progress? I mean, maybe now with the confetti weapons, it's easier. How to play Last Gen Earth on my PC. Says top rank J uh, by getting an emulator, an Android emulator. Just go on Google, type Android emulator, and you'll learn everything you need to know about it. I need to chop down a few more trees. You will unlock. You are a brave boy. I mean, I maybe will unlock it one day. But I don't know when is that day. <laughs> maybe I will start gathering those corn seeds. You forgot to cook some fish. The fish doesn't do anything. The fish doesn't do anything.
Okay, we got another tree. Can I like, I still can't split that enough. Yikes. And the dude aggroed the entire swamp location. It's so annoying. It is very, very annoying. But it is what it is. Did you get any ash trees? Well, you got at least something. Use Glocks. Thanks. I was using a spears here. And now I'm using Glocks. Thanks. Do you think it's worth it to use guns in the festival event? Maybe. 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 I just saw your Days Gone series. It was awesome. Loved that game. I'm glad you watched it. And I'm glad you enjoyed it. I love the Days Gone as well. The silly seeds. I'm probably just gonna delete them. And maybe like, psych, don't do it. That's it. They're gone. Now I can go on auto. And I can chop down these trees. So I'm just getting two stacks and then we are skedaddling from here. Because then we have other things to do. I still have... Uh, the, the entire Forlorn Fair to clear. I haven't done any tasks in the Forlorn Fair event yet. It's gonna be sad when the Forlorn Fair event... ...disappears. <laughs> Where to get flare guns? You can get them from the farm location. Sometimes you get them. You don't always get them. Do you do 99 waves event? Yes, I've done it yesterday. During the last live stream. Was it yesterday? Probably it was. Okay. That's silly. It's like, can you do your old intro? I have no idea what, what do you mean by my, my old intro. It's never changed. It's always been like that. Never changed any intros. I missed the raid. How was it? Says Erpin. One of the best raids I've raided. That's what I would like to say. But it was a pretty goopy raid as well. What's wrong with new raids? They're not new raids. They're just goop. They're still old raids. They're just bad. I haven't gotten a good raid in a really long time. I've done three raids today and three of those raids were pretty, pretty goop. If you want open boxes in that location. Yeah, okay, let's open up a box here as well. Uh, we got some beans. You don't really get anything special in these locations either. It's like the same... The same zone as... As, as other locations. Same loot. I've been playing this game for three years and I still don't have a true friend, Doggo. I've spent thousands of hours and dollars. Alrighty. It is what it is. That's pretty good. I mean, we did get a, a shotgun. That was pretty decent. What do you say about the Westland Survival? I have made a few videos on Westland Survival. I'm sure they've changed a lot of stuff there as well as there have been a few updates. And there are some people in the chat that play Westland Survival maybe even more than last day on Earth. I don't know. Maybe one day I'll play more Westland Survival. Okay, let's open up one more chest here and let's see if we have... Oh, we've gotten another Glock and we did get, guys, two stacks of wood. So that is it. We're gonna skedaddle from this place. There's nothing else we can kind of do here. So 
Let's just skedaddle. I got two stacks of wood. That's all I came here for. And that's it. Westland survival has not changed much at all. Uh, okay, then maybe it hasn't changed much at all. I've just seen some people in the chat saying, Oh, check out Westland survival. It's changed a lot. But the same people also say that Lias and Earth has changed a lot. But it's always been the same, so... Yeah. So, hey, that was the swamp, ladies and gentlemen. Check when the Forlorn Fair ends. It ends in three days and uh, six, seven hours. There we go, in six hours. Three days and six hours. Thank you for doing it. You're welcome, Aspratus. You're welcome. I'll do motel. Guys, stop it! I'm not going to the motel. I have things to do. We got things to do! We got more important things to do than clearing the motel. There is the Forlorn Fair event waiting for us. Free to play when? In 2023, hopefully, this year. I don't know when. I don't know the exact date, though. But the sooner, the better. That's all I can say. He hates motel, says Lila. I don't really hate it. I do hate it. Maybe hate is a strong word. I just don't like the motel. Why would I go to the motel? It has absolutely nothing. Scum, when, play. There will be more scum survival as well. I just don't know when. Why did I just sort out the guns? I need them for the forlorn fair. <gasps> okay, let's get these goopy weapons. Let's get some flare guns. And uh, what else do I need? Um, I'm thinking. That's way too many weapons. We totally don't need that many. I'm gonna get two machetes. Alright, I like my machetes. I wanna use them. We got them. I'll use them. Okay, that's enough. Let's upgrade the guns and let's go. Also, maybe a spread shot. What if motel becomes forlorn and fair? Well, then I'll go to the motel. Do you like posting videos or streaming, says Irfan. Uh, that's a good question. I like doing both. I used to post videos and live streams, like I used to do two things a day, but now there's just not enough content in Last Dinner to do that kind of stuff, so... Sadly, I can't do it anymore. But once I find a cool game, once maybe there's more content in Last Dinner, then you can expect a live stream plus a video during the same day. It's just now there's not enough content for it for me to do that. A uh, bear tea. Maybe I shouldn't have gotten the bear tea. Maybe I should have gotten a torch. Because sometimes you do need a torch for that event. Your head isn't so shiny today. Guys, my head is never shiny. Stop it. What are you talking about? Barity wires jerky. We'll take that stuff after I'm done doing the task. Then I'll come back here again. It'll be uh, simpler. Okay, let's talk to the woods, dude. Last time I forgot to feed the horse, it nearly bit my finger off. They'll make her starve. Pick some carrots from the garden. Uh, hey, was that William? Can't remember where exactly he buried the chest in the woods. Grab a shovel and go looking for it. If you find it, you can have it. The dog will pick up the trail. Just feed it first. 
And every night when I wake up uh, from nightmares in the morning, I find strange footprints near the camp. Find out what it is. Okay, we've got uh, three tasks from this dude. So we have to go to limestone cliffs. We have to feed the doggos and kill six deer. Okay, that's a lot of stuff. We will do this. Okay, first of all, now we maybe have to do the turkey event. Let's begin. We know what's up, so we can do the turkey event. Did you recycle the juggernaut yet? Nope, I haven't recycled it yet. All right. Okay, well, I can't pick it up! Okay, there's just a... I couldn't pick up that other one. Okay, there's just a shadow. I think that turkey is just there to... To, 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 to disturb me. Oh my goodness, I don't mean to punch it, it'll die soon! Dude, that turkey is annoying. Actually, it is annoying when they disturb you. Oh my goodness. I, I'm, I'm gonna lose this event. I'm gonna fail this event. Just attack them! Okay. Dude, I'm gonna fail this event. Okay, we did it. Somehow, somehow we did it. That other turkey was really annoying. It was really annoying. Kowalski! What the hell? So yeah, that's why this turkey is... Oh, this turkey doesn't even have a number. I thought the turkey with a number will go after him. I thought this is Kowalski. What, what's up with the shadow? We'll just beat up the shadow and that's it. Now he's quiet. Understandable. Have a nice day. Let's get the loot. Shadow is special. It's 70 points. I couldn't pick it up. Well, Jordan Hamzy. Welcome. It's simple. I say you do it. All right. Yes, chef. Turn the fire up. Okay, last time we had to turn up the fire as well. Uh, we have to turn the fire up again? What are you cooking there? Okay, now we have to add berries. Gordon Ramsay, do be like that. And we have to add some meat. More meat. Bears and meat. Like, what kind of food is this? And more berries. So, yeah, just berries and meat. That's it. We did see when it's good, it's good. Don't forget your reward in the chest. I'll get it. I'll get the rewards. 100% precision. Yep. Okay, we only got two carrots. There, there's got to be a third carrot here somewhere, but it's gone now. <sighs> okay, I want to feed that horse. I haven't fed it before. This is my first time when, when I have this event. Okay, the doggo, the the horse, is here. Yeah, it needs three carrots, and I have only two. That those things ate the carrots. <gasps> I don't have any carrots here. I'll have to go back to the base for the carrots. Unbelievable. Kill the deer. I mean, that's a lot of deer here, actually. That's a... Uh... Do I really have to kill them? Why would I kill them? More confettis. Okay, I'll have to begin this event. Wait, before we begin that, though... I want to deal with the bull first. Let's talk to this guy. It's crazy, blah, blah, blah. Okay, but we'll do it. Um, yeah, I guess let's just deal with it. Should be pretty easy. Kill six deer event. Oh, that's the event where we have to kill six deer. I didn't even know. Okay, but we'll kill them then. I didn't see that there's an event. Where we have to kill six deer. Okay, that bull's gonna... Charge now. 
Okay. Have you found the doggo's cave already besides the first time when you didn't have the doggo with you? No, I didn't find that doggo cave yet. Okay, the dude's gonna explode again. Okay, we just need to explode one more barrel. Come to Papa Schmuck. Okay. Maybe it won't even explode him. Okay, that's it. We did it. Sheesh. We destroyed the bull. I thought I died for a second because the game like kind of froze there. I was like, wait, what happened? Thought it died. Okay, let's deal with these deer then. That's three deer. Oh dear. Four deer. Five. And uh, here comes the sixth one. Okay, we did that. Still have to feed the doggo, so I still need to get some more carrots and I still don't have them. Well, whatever. Let's now do this event. Let's protect these guys. Forgot about the generator. I was waiting for them to spawn. Okay, let's start the generator. The generator is on. Alrighty, I might even get a machete here. Dear Lord, yes indeed. Dear Lord wouldn't be too pleased with us. Just destroyed all the deer. Turn on the music, it's very nice. I don't know if I trust it, maybe it's copyrighted or something, so that's why I'm now turning it on. Where's the concert music? I'm not turning it on, as I said, maybe it's copyrighted or something. That's the reason why it's not on. Oh, we have to launch the fireworks, just realized that. This. This, and uh, another one here. Stupid floater bloater. I just realized it says six years here. Okay, that's interesting. That is cool. Sneak attack the zombies. Wait, can you sneak attack them? Maybe some of them. Well, there we go. We did it. A couple more rehearsals and we'll pack the stadium. Thank you. Now we can get the loot from the box what mods for the shotgun I got these mods here sneak attack them it's fine um, I'm gonna give this these things here I still haven't gotten all of the confettis have I Oh, I also have to feed the doggo. I did feed the pooch. Oh, now I can go to the pine bushes. All right. Wait, I can find more stash. Eh, hey, not stash, but the more, more, more confettis. I forgot where is it. There we go. There's the confettis thing. There it is. Okay, now we need to get some carrots for the doggo, which this time this event didn't spawn enough carrots. So I'll have to go back to the base and get them. And on top of that, we need to go now to the pine bushes and 
and the limestone cliffs. Okay, we will do this. Carrots for the doggo. I mean, doggos eat carrots. Doggos do eat carrots. It's like a snack for them, from what I know. Maybe not really like a snack, a snack, but they eat carrots. Take a shovel, says Board Sus. Oh, we also need a shovel. Uh. Okay, so we gotta go back to the base then to get a shovel. I'm telling you, like 60% of the game is spent just by prepping and traveling from one location to another location. Okay, let's rub the confetti. I'm gonna give the meat to the doggos because what else am I gonna do with it? Go on, eat that goop. We get three more after cleaning the pine bush task. Yes, indeed. You are right. Uh, I haven't given these things yet. Okay, I will give them. Uh, they said I need a shovel. Whatever the name... Whatever the dude's name is, I forgot his name. Well, the guy that gave me the task. Now we need some berry tea. This. Uh, wires. Thick cloth. Don't forget three carrots. Oh, yeah, we absolutely need those three carrots. We will get them. And we need charcoal and glass. Okay, no more glass here. Do I have some glass here? Yes, I do. Let's get this and some charcoal. Carrots are good for rabbits or nothing else. People eat carrots. What do you mean they're only good for rabbits? People eat carrots. Doggos eat carrots. Uh, what else do we need? This, the carrots, and the shovel. I think we got everything. There's nothing else we need to bring. Beautiful. It's golden. Has the sewer timer refreshed? It probably has refreshed a while ago. We can definitely go to the sewers. Um, pine bushes and the limestone cliffs. Let's go to the limestone cliffs first, then we'll go to the pine bushes, then we'll finish with the forlorn fairy event, and then we're gonna craft some scars, and then we'll go to the sewers probably. Drone, kidding. Glad that we don't need the drone for the... For these events. Get the doggo. The doggo already followed us here, probably. I assume. Here we just have to kill the zombies. Whoops. Sadly, I ran out of my shotguns. Those were pretty good. One more schmuck. Except I can't find it. All of this running uh, around those zombies. Reminds me of Sector 7. Or the crater, whatever you want to call it. Maybe we'll go there one day. Today I actually thought about going to the crater. But maybe not yet. Oh lord, I don't see another golden zombie.
I don't see it. For real. Maybe I have to like re-enter this location again probably, but there have to be five zombies. <sighs> yeah, I'll probably just re-enter, but at the same time, uh, feels weird. Carrots are good for eyes, maybe. That's at least what people say, but is that true? In stage three, there is a in stage three there is a special arrow that shows you where to look for zombies. I guess maybe that's cool. Did you know that the true friend Rottweiler does about 30 damage from the fighter Doggo perk? That's epic. Not sewers. I need a lab run. Thorough. Okay, I'm going. You're not paying attention, says Kevin. Alright. I mean, I'm not gonna clear the laboratory because you told me that I have to clear the laboratory. I've cleared it yesterday, but alright, Boomer. I said that we are gonna clear the sewers. That means we are gonna clear the sewers. Now, stop it and get some help. Okay, let's get that all. 30 damage is OP. I mean, even the current Duggo does a decent amount of damage. Wait, let's... Okay, it does 19. Okay, that's not great. Plus, I think I can increase his damage by 2. Or by plus 1. I think he can do 20 now. So yeah, 30 damage is pretty OP. Pine bushes. Let's go here. Welcome to those that have just joined. Welcome, welcome. Glad to see you all over here. We are currently clearing the Forlorn Fair. It's kind of interesting how how the chat works. Sometimes there will be like three, four, five people saying hi at the same time. So that's when I usually say hi to those that have just joined. can also use rations to get more forlorn fair points probably uh find the dog okay let's get the dog now i have to find the dog and then i have to find the treasure okay well i got the doggo now show me What was inside of the stash? Except it doesn't work! Okay, this time it worked. We just got goop. That is it! That was a stash! Thank you for nothing! <laughs> well, here I can dig out some more stuff. YouTube notifications are pretty lame uh, these times, that's why. Uh, not a lot of people come here from notifications. It's just probably the the live stream gets recommended at the same time. To a group of people and that's how they find the live stream. Hi, hi, hi. See lots of eyes. I was like, for a second, I didn't understand what was going on. Welcome. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome. I was lost for a second. I looked at the chat and then I saw like a bunch of eyes. Hi, 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 hi. Welcome, welcome.
Okay, let's give the goop. Let's feed the doggo. Hopefully, I still have those carrots. Yes. I'm glad that I didn't eat them. Okay, let's feed the horse. Now we can get loot from here. Some more confetti. There we go. We have leveled up to level six. Let's get this. A grenade launcher. Now let's open up that fair coupon. Good evening, mate. We've gotten just one protector. Last time we were getting two guns. Now we get only one. Okay. Well, this is kind of goop. I don't want it. All right. Now let's bring all of this stuff back to the base. And uh, let's come back here with a bunch of scars as we're going to mod all of them. And then we're going to clear the, the sewer location with scars. Unbelievable. State of, State of the K3. Do you play? State of the K3 is not out. State of decay three. It's not out. There is state of decay two, however, and I have played state of decay two. It's like, is the bookshelf rain proof? Yes, at least as of right now, raiders cannot get any loot from the bookshelf. How about Days Gone 2? Days Gone 2 is not as well out. It's not out. What is out though? Wait, we got a grenade launcher. When did, where did I get a grenade launcher? I didn't see that I've gotten a grenade launcher. Can somebody tell me where I got it? I literally got the grenade launcher. I was probably looking at the chat and I didn't see it. It didn't trigger in my head. Did we get it from the Forlorn Fair coupon? Maybe we did get it from there. That's where I that's where I think we got it. That's where we got it from. Forlore and fair from fair from that coupon thing. That's great then. That is epic. That is absolutely epic. Oh, from the level up. I get it. Not from the coupon, but from the level I see. Now I remember that we got it. Now I remember. Okay. Understandable. Have a nice day. How about we drop this here? I need to drop some leather. You got it from the ticket. Yeah, yeah. Now I remember. I remember that. Yes. Totally. Okay. How many of these things we got? 20. Uh, 27. That's pretty decent. That's about like nine, right? Yeah, that's gotta be nine. That's nine scars. Nine scars! Nine! <laughs> that sounded German. One, two, three. Dude, I don't even have that many. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Dude, I'm, I'm gonna mod all of these weapons. And yet... I'll have a bunch of spare ones. Okay, clearing sewers with scars is kind of funny. It is. It is funny. First of all, I need to modify those scars because later on you can't modify them once they have... Uh, ...candy wrapped around them or whatever we put in that stuff. It hurts every time. Oh, it's better to use. No, it's not better. Somebody said that it's better to use at the transport hub. It's not better because at the transport hub, the zombies have have armor. And if zombies have armor, you do less damage. And if you do less damage, you get less forlorn points. Capiche? So, no, it is not better to use these scars at the, at the transport hub or anywhere else. The sewers. Do you understand that? The sewers. They're pretty expensive, however. So where should we use it? In the sewers! How many times do I have to say this? In the sewers! Because zombies in the sewers don't have any armor. You can use it in the sewers. Sag, where do you use the guns? Sewers! 
Okay, let's go on out to the sewers, ladies and gentlemen. The police department is good too with the waves. The the zombies there have armor as well. So it's not that good either. Don't uh, don't scream or I'll go deaf. It wasn't that loud. I think hard mode lab is best. You can guys Okay, so here's what I say. If you think something, you can believe in whatever you want. There are people that believe that Earth is flat. I am telling you that if zombies have armor, you will get less forlorn fair points. So if you modify your scar just to get forlorn fair points, if that's the sole reason why you modify them, then you're just wasting them if you're, let's say, clear the transport hub with it or the laboratory. But... Yeah. To those that care about tips and tricks... Zombies don't have any armor in the sewer location. So if you want to maximize the amount of... Oh, no, I came here for no reason. It's all because of the stupid comments. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. So, yeah, but to those that want to... That, that appreciate tips and tricks and that want to maximize their confettis and maximize their forlorn points growth, then... Then clear the sewer location. Also, you can craft a pipe, and with that pipe, you can go to the police department and you can keep sneak attacking the Hungry Chomper or whatever the dude's name is. You'll be able to get a lot of points, but you have to keep re-entering the location all the time, or you have to wait until... Yeah, you have to re-enter that location all the time, and you have to wait until the dude restores his health. So that'll take, like, quite a while. That'll take hours to do it, so it's not really worth it. In any case... Earth is a triangle. It says whaled eye. Okay. Alright, boomers. Wait, what if I click skip? Oh no, it did take a coin! Sometimes it doesn't! Sometimes when it says one coin, it'll take zero coins anyways. Well, whatever. I'll wait my five seconds then. <gasps> Dude, that is a lot of scars. There's no way we... I'll use all of them at the sewers here. I'll have to wait until it resets again. But it's gonna be the easiest sewer I've ever done. It is somewhat of a of a waste. Like, let's say if you don't care about this event that much, then it's not really worth it for you to modify these these scars, anyways. In any case, let's get that all. Uh, how many points did I... I didn't check how many points I have for... Uh, whatever, let's talk to this dude. I'm also gonna take a picture. And I wanna know how many points I can get. Check the points first. Yes, indeed, that's what we're gonna do. Yes, indeed. Yes, sir. Isn't the farm good for points? Just asking, says Luca. You didn't have to say just asking. It's not like I would scream at you. And no, the farm is not good for points. As zombies at the farm also have armor. Okay, this dude. We're at level six. Let's snap a picture real quick. When I take a picture, the, the phone detects the face of this guy. Okay. That is funny. Obviously, guys, I'm joking when I scream, right? It's not like I'm really that angry. I think I have to say this because maybe some people will be like, oh my god, sick. You're unstable. Don't stop screaming. D did you kill the new zombie called Firearm Zombie with 3000 health? I don't know, never seen it. If I'm not mistaken, it's probably a zombie from from the third stage, maybe because 
if it's not from there, then I don't know where you can find that zombie. <sighs> N uh, roughly 1920k, so three levels of Biraja. Alrighty. I don't think we'll get 19 to 20k, but we'll see. Don't scream, man. There are people sleeping here, says Jason. First of all, when I scream, it doesn't mean that it gets very loud. There are compressors and other stuff going, so it does get louder, but it doesn't get super loud. And maybe if you shout more, there won't be any more stupid questions. Exactly. If you don't scream at people, they won't understand. You have to yell at them. That's the only way of uh, how you can convey information to people. They have to be yelled at. Why am I at the laboratory when I have to go to the sewers? I, Dude, we're not going to go to the sewers today. Why go to the lab? I don't know why I go to the lab. The brain is lagging. Why so serious, says Lazy Show, because it's a serious live stream. We don't have any funny business here. Do you think it's a comedy club? Methods of good communication. Screaming, says Boren says. Absolutely. Absolutely. Screaming equals funny. That's about right. break all of these scars. I think we'll still have like maybe three scars left. Okay, at least we're getting four Lord points. When my guns miss, yeah, we'll lose the durability. But scars don't really miss a lot. They almost never miss. Right, it's gonna... Imagine I go to the top and I die with all of these scars. That'll be very disappointing. That'll be extremely disappointing, extremely sad, and uh, the live stream just ends right there, right then. So there's no transport hub today. I mean, I don't know. We'll see. It does miss once in a while, but it's not that bad. Yeah, but we'll still have a bunch of... Take a reanimator. I do believe that maybe we should take a reanimator. Maybe I am a noob. Maybe I should take a reanimator. Like, for real. For realsies. The animation of firing is very satisfying, says Boren says. Good for you. It is pretty satisfying. Pop it now, guys. <laughs> Do I want to pop it? I'm not scared. I don't need that thing, guys. We're not going to die. It's impossible for us to die with these scars. If I die, I am a stinky loser. Bro, scared to die for content. Content! I'll lose seven scars! That is content. Dying and losing seven scars. Seven confetti modded scars. That is absolutely content. Totally content. Oh, if you die, watch an ad and you can restore it. Oh yeah, if the game doesn't lag with ads. Those confettis look like gun skins. Yep, it's only the matter of time when we get gun skins. I like clearing the sewers this way. It's pretty easy. The, then crash when watching ads. That's probably what'll happen. The game will crash when I'll watch an ad if I die, but hopefully I won't die because I don't want to die. Uh, 
this. I don't have any food. So let's keep going. Imagine I starve to death. In the sewers and then I lose everything. <laughs> keep watching to find out if Sayak dies. Or if Sayak survives. Leave some guns in that chest. Nah, 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 nah. We're gonna take everything. Imagine if you recycle these scars, you get back your your confettis. All or nothing. Exactly. All or nothing. It's all about content. If you look at the chat room more often, you will surely die. I mean, I can't stop looking at the chat. It's like a habit, so... If I die, it is... We're gonna share the blame, guys, alright? If I die, maybe it's not fully my fault. We're all gonna be stinky losers. If I die, your guys are stinky losers as, as well, so... Hey. Be careful. Guess that's only fair. Die for content. <laughs> Your definition of content is very weird. However, I do agree that that would be nice content. I accept zero responsibility if that happens as the A. I mean, you don't have to accept or not accept any responsibility. You will be just a stinky loser and that's it. No matter if you accept the responsibility or not. It is what it is, so hopefully I don't die. So all of you hold the fingers crossed so that I don't die here. Okay, that's it. We still have six scars. Dude, that, that'll be so many scars. What else am I gonna do with them? I'll have to wait for another sewer reset to use them. Or maybe I will have to use them at the PD, even though it's not that worth it. In that case, it's all my fault, says the... Yes, if I die, it's all your fault. Yes, yes, yes. That sounds great. I hope they had craftable bombs with nails, bolts, and stuff. Says Jason. Alrighty. Maybe one day. You can use them at the farm. You receive double points there. <sighs> yes. But they also... Zombies also have armor in the farm. So you don't get enough points. Like, for example, here I get 20 points per shot. 9 points, not 20 points. But yeah, at the farm I won't be getting that many points. As they have some armor. However, maybe I will use them at the farm. Because it looks like we have too many of them. So I'll have to use them somewhere. This dude is going to die. The best place to use these scars is at the sewers because zombies at the sewers have no... Have no armor. I had 39 health there. That was kind of scary. Okay, we need to activate this. Okay, the turret is gonna start shooting the big one. You grind in the settlement today. Yes, indeed. I did grind in the settlement. I'm grinding in the settlement right now. Kind of wasted the scar in this big one, but that's okay. So we still have six scars left. Okay, so we're getting more scars. 
We're getting more confettis than I can use at the sewers. So we will have to do something about that. Hmm. Hmm. I took nine scars and we have six. So we've used up three scars. So you need three scars to clear the sewers. Okay. We will have to use them somewhere. Maybe I'll be using them at the transport hub, even though it's kind of silly, but I'll have to use them there. It depends. I'll be clearing the sewers. Reset the sewers. It's very expensive to reset them. It's like... Uh, 40 or something. Rations. Ration reset sewers. Yeah, it's very expensive. It's a lot of rations. Why are you not looting everything to VIP? Because what I'm going to do with that rope... So yeah, I'll be probably saving these scars for now. But... Yeah, I'll be saving them. I'll try to clear as many sewers as possible. But as soon as... I see that there's like one day left... In the Forlorn Fair, I will just blast these scars at the farm and at the transport hub and everywhere else. At the lab. What about the components? We have enough components for for three generations. Saving. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day has been ruined, says the eight. Exactly. We will save these scars. You should repair the scars at the gas station if you can. Sadly, you cannot repair them. Bunker Alpha, you don't get points at Bunker Alpha. Well, maybe you do. Maybe it's even better to clear Bunker Alpha with these scars. Well, we'll have to check it out. Maybe it is better to clear Bunker Alpha with these scars. Like, you don't get double the points, but the zombies don't have any armor there either. Three scars, six, seven K points. I mean, let's see how many points we've gotten. Let's ask the devs for rations. I can't ask an infinite amount of rations. There's a limit of how many rations I can ask a month. So it's not like I can go and reset that... Um, the, the sewers. It's not like I can't keep resetting those sewers often. So hopefully that makes sense why I'm saving those rations. Alright, let's talk to William now. We are at level 7 and we have 400 points. I was at level 6. So, wait a second. So, if I'm not mistaken, we've gotten 5,768 points, right? <laughs> that was rationing the rations. It do be like that. So, yeah, we... We have gotten uh, almost 6k points. Which is pretty decent. So we get around 1,900 points per one scar. Background noise, very annoying. Jonathan, is that you that every live stream, every single live stream, it'll say something about the background music? That it's very loud, it's annoying, that it's something. It's not funny, John. I, you say that thing every live stream. Get some help. Play heavy metal tomorrow just for him. <sighs> oh, let's read those and let's put the scars here. You know what? I kind of want to keep the scars in 
this box. I love the music in the background. To be honest, I mean, there has to be something playing there. So like every second, every nanosecond of the background music has to be like the best music you've ever heard in your entire life. Just has to be something there and that's it. Uh, we need to drop some machetes. Ladies and gentlemen, blip blop. No space. Unbelievable. And the pump. I don't even know where I store these pumps. So for now, I'm just gonna drop here. That was the best thing that I've done. Like having this rack where I just store garbage is amazing. It's a lot faster to sort out the inventory. Maybe for you, it still seems slow. It's not slower, it's faster, guys. It is a lot faster to sort out the inventory now. Because usually those little things took me forever to find where I store, like, those pumps or something. Now it's just fast. Have you seen the cat at the Forlorn Fair? That cat has been everywhere. At the fishing event. At the transport hub. I think you can... Yeah, you can see them at the transport hub for sure. The junk chest is better than actual junk chest. Exactly. Exactly. Do you feel like PD is giving us less blue cards now? I did 63 waves yesterday and I got only 7 blue cards, says uh, Ona Longu. Not really. It's all random. Yesterday I've done 40 waves and I've gotten only 2 blue cards, but after doing 99 waves, we've gotten like, what, 20 plus blue? So, we did get more more blue cards at the end. So maybe you didn't get a lot of cards at wave 60. Maybe you would have gotten more cards at wave 70, 80, 90. But yeah. Sometimes you just don't get a lot of cards. Sometimes it's just like that. So I don't think they nerfed anything. I think it's all random. Sometimes I don't get a lot of cards. Sometimes you get more, sometimes you get less. So it is all random. The last of us background music is pleasing. It is pleasing. Except I don't think I can use it here as, as... As maybe it's copyrighted or something. So all of the stuff is from the YouTube library. YouTube music library. So yeah, we spoke about the stuff that the... Blue crates from the police department are random. You know what is not random though? GeoGuessr. GeoGuessr. We're gonna touch a little bit of grass, ladies and gentlemen. Finally, yes indeed, finally. We're going to play some Jill Gisser. Bam, bam. Yeah. There's also like some sort of a rank in Jill Gisser. You can know if you're silver, gold or whatever, but... I know nothing about those ranks. They added like some sort of music here to Jill Gisser. How do I stop it? They have no Jill Gisser music here. How do I make it quiet? Wait, how do I... Oh. There we go. The music is off. Um... I am very lost. I actually don't know where we are. I mean, it's maybe somewhere in China. Maybe not. Doesn't look like it at all. A oh, while wow, they had to change the thing. Um, I don't know where we are. I literally don't have a slightest clue. I'm gonna go here, here. -ish. It's not that for sure. While wow, the ending music is crazy. The ending music is crazy. That was some sort of an island all the way here. Northern uh, Mariana Islands. Okay, that's where it was. Wow, those... That that thing definitely scared me. I was like, wait, why is that music playing here? 
That was probably very loud though. We, we can maybe lower the effect music here. There we go. Okay, it is probably Russia. Maybe it's not. Okay, it is Russian. Mm, and again, it can be God knows where. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go around here. I know if I like this new timer thing, it is scary. The new timer is scary. Oh my god, anxiety music. That timer is scary. I'm telling you. The timer is scary. Very good. It was in Moscow, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my goodness. These places, they're so annoying. Just let me go on the road. Okay, that's a lot of builders. Well, it's somewhere in Asia, that's what I know. That's what it feels like. here Cambodia just because it's closer to other things it's in the very middle of everything I'm gonna wait for the last second so that they can't switch their guess there we go the guy couldn't change his guess <laughs> we did it ladies and gentlemen it was actual in Cambodia bloody hell I'm amazing that's all I have to say I went here in the middle because it could have been Thailand maybe it could have been somewhere else on those other islands so I just wanted to go in the middle that's it now it's 1v1 ladies and gents if I win this I win this if I lose I lose it's pretty simple. And again, it's somewhere in Asia. There's no way I'll guess it. So it'll just be random. Is it in Asia even? Yeah, there's no way I'll guess it. It is somewhere in Asia. 100%. However, where is it? They're driving on the right side. So... Um, it's probably not even... This... There we go. I'm, I'm gonna get knocked out. It's not Taiwan for sure. Yeah, it's not that. I got completely destroyed. It was in... Where? Albania? It was in Albania. Bruh! Bruh! Got completely destroyed. It didn't look like Taiwan, but I just didn't know what else we can choose there. But it was Albania. It didn't look like that at all. It looked very Asian here, but what do I know? Ladies and gentlemen, it is what it is. We did touch a little bit of grass. What did we learn today? Nothing. Again, I can't go again because... Uh, the I need to wait 10 more minutes until I can go again. See the speed sign? I did see the speed sign. It did look European. So yeah, it is what it is, ladies and gentlemen. What did we learn today? That Albania looks a little bit like uh, Asia. At least to me. To my eyes. In any case... See you guys later. See you tomorrow with another... Uh, with another video. Yeah, see you tomorrow with another video. So, take care, everybody. It, or another live stream. Or maybe a video. It depends. If I've done two live streams, then tomorrow is a video. I try not to do three live streams in a row. I try to do two live streams in one video. But we'll see. Take care, everybody. See you tomorrow with whatever. It'll be a video or a live stream. There will be something. Take care, everybody. Shout out to all of you. And see you tomorrow. Take care.